Hey folks, I'm Surveying Glory and welcome to part 111 of my Scottish campaign in Crusader Kings 2. Uh, so as usual, we are fighting a civil war against Duke Tlurgan of Moray this time. Uh, young Elaine has finished her education and diplomacy. Who is Elaine? Um, in person, I don't know. Fine, she's a lunatic. Young Sarah. He was not a lunatic. Um, who are these people? I guess their people are captured. Uh, great, very good. Uh, yep, so... Yeah, we've been fighting a number of civil wars in the last few years. There have been a number of changes of monarch in that time as well. Oh, there's a big army appeared. I will be going after them when you've done your siege. Where am I? I thought, am I not a siege leader? Right, well they're going to finish the siege first actually. Good, I'm right, going to hit them now. And uh, I do need to check out Make sure that I'm in charge of the sieges. Or oh, actually, was that the last king? I can't remember which king it was. Uh, heading back into Lothian. Great, we'll catch you there. Uh, you stay. Oh, you can't siege any further. Uh, no, I'm not. Siege leader. That must have been another character. Okay. Tell you what then, you're heading into Tiviatdale, so you at Tiviatdale, you stay where you are. But let's see, just check make sure. Ah, there we are. Duke Ninian of Lancaster. You're in charge. Yeah, Ninian was the king for about a couple of weeks, I think. No, maybe a bit longer than that. Actually, I think I'm going to have a look at that. Okay, Cumberland. Catch them there. Okay, we're going to lose a county on death of the Earl. That TV deal. But let me have a look here. History. Uh, yeah, so let's go back. Cadog the Wise, Breath the Accursed, the King of England, that's right, so 7th of January 1136, four years later, four and a half years later, Huid the Cruel was elected the King, and then Breath the Accursed of England. So for four years, and then Cadog the Wise conquered it. Ten years later, Cadog II was elected. Two and a half years, roughly. Two years, five months. Ninian III was elected. And then five years, he managed to stay on the throne uh, before Anil was elected. And then Cadog came back. Yeah. Three months. Less than four months. I... Uh, and I did play that character and I managed to get him to die of an infected wound. So there's been quite a period of unrest rest over the last 20 years. It's about time we settled down. Who wants to get married? Countess Mayor of Ulster and Urp Markarurst. Heir to the Duchy of Marrakesh. Great, go for it. <coughs> Wish you long life and happiness. Let me go back into there now. Let's get rid of these messages. Church infrastructure. Couple of victories. 63%. Okay, back in there. I could raise more troops, I suppose. 
You guys just jump in there. Is there space? You guys come up and siege Cumberland. You guys stand down. You guys group up and come up here to Northumberland. You guys stand down. So you can stay put there. Well, in fact, go in there and finish that off. Um, no, okay, somebody's trying to kill me. Go into hiding, I don't think so. Now, Is it worth sending somebody up there? Why not? Change my mind. You get into Cumberland, you come up. And you go to Orkney. Well, it might be over by the time you get there, right enough. Don't really think so. These two guys running like hell. What? There's an army coming. My liege, during my stay in York I have found a great philosopher who has agreed to help me with my studies to enhance culture in the country, or in the county. With your permission I would suggest that we employ him. Of course... No, that's outrageously expensive. Okay. And the siege here is complete. So you come down into Northumberland, kill that army, and siege down that province. Well, you're not going to kill the army, are you? You're going to. Um, this hurt it a bit. Oh no, you killed it! Well done. Kill surprise. How are things looking in terms of our vassals? They're not too bad. <laughs> well, having said that, you look at it this way. You're not in the council. Might take her off. I will play as Ninny and the Cruel. Excellent. 91%. Apparently one of the courtiers has been annoying my wife, Theodosia, and instead of asking me for help, she took the matter in her own hands and made sure the courtier would never annoy her again, or he'd know the consequences. Uh, my marshal. So you don't like me because I'm a, well, you like me, but I'm a tyrant. I have too many old duchies. I'll trust in the final can change by 15. I think it's down by five. Uh, I would like to try and have at least one more child. Try and get this genius straight into the bloodline. Well, I'm here. Uh, so, yeah, sorry, old Rustin, but get out of her grill.
What's this now? This looks important. Queen. Ah. There's my boy. There he's. Right. Decline that for now. Um, range betrothal. This looks too good to be true. What am I missing here? Something fishy there. So my son could inherit all of that. Cool. Right, it's not got much longer until we've won this war. And hopefully we can get a bit of peace and quiet for a while. There we go. Offer peace, enforce demands. The revolt is over. I have one. Stand down troops. Okay. I could hold a grand tournament to celebrate my stunning victory, but wasn't that stunning, I suppose. Let's pause for a bit and see what we can do. Um, I'm no longer... Well, it's okay for Ninian to lead armies. Sort of. Don't want them to die. I want to check. So I hold York and Essex. Albany again. Which is when I need to give away. Who do we have in Albany? You don't like me. You don't like me too much, but then no, you're a heretic, and I think to be honest, I would rather it stayed in my own household. So I hold faith. You don't like me at all. So let's find somebody to give faith to. Yeah, there we go. Not only that, you can take the duchy as well. Rule it wisely, my son. Uh, there he is. So I'm his heir. His regent is Earl Carrost of Athol. He doesn't particularly like me. Right. Pause for now. I want to check out our... Um, what you call them? Prisoners. The people that live in my prison. Far too many. Let's ransom you. And you. Dressed. Duke of the Isles. Son of the Devil. You're staying where you are. Elaine, don't know who you are. Duchess of Mercia. I guess you're staying put. Madru, you can't be ransomed. Very. 
You can't be ransomed. Sarah, you can't be ransomed. Tolkien. <laughs> Seriously? You like me at 11? Even though you're in prison? Why the hell did you attack me then? Well, maybe I suppose you didn't. You just refused to be arrested. But you were doing something naughty, which meant that's why I had to arrest you. Goodness. Duke Dress, son of the devil, is complaining about his dark cell in the dungeon. And um, now that is unfortunate. Oublié for you. And we have take not to stop plots off. Chancellor Duke Carrost is doing a superb job. I'm having trouble with a town and a castle in York. I uh, the towns. This is not good. These people back in it as well. End plot. Oh, you little. Alright. So, you're leading this. Earl of Kent. You are in Essex to fabricate claims. You're my Chancellor. No, you're not. You're not my Chancellor. But you've lost all your support. That's good. Um, I can just about get rid of you. Actually, there you are. You're not even Scottish. Well, you're sort of Scottish. You're part of my dentist and you're Pictish. Okay. Well, your plot's not going to work. Anyway. Earl Erpin for Scotland being led by Duke and became the Quarreller. Reigning in the Isle of Man. So, go on, want my counsel, thank you. Spymaster. In there. <clears throat> okay, masses of money. Making a lot per turn. My efforts to squeeze some extra taxes out of the population have met with a resistance. Troublesome peasants. Never mind. Ah, I think I have honorary titles to bestow. Uh, ordinary title, designated region. There we are. And Seneschal. And you are already a commander. Great. What's this? Who's voting for what? That's something I need to look at. My uncle Duke Billy has asked me to spend some quality family time in Reading. The opinion of me is one. Let's go for a visit. Uh, really strengthened our family bonds. Great. I was thinking about something and I forgot now what it was. Yes. I want to check this out. War declaration, the council, nothing but opponents. I could live with that for a while though, I suppose. But, having said that, I do want to... maybe rework the council a bit. You get a ten years hold on the heir to the kingdom's position. Vestiture of people, that's fine. Domain size got up by three. 
vassal limit down. I could cope with that. We could get it through. But do I want a bigger domain size? I'm quite happy with what I'm holding just now. I think I'll leave that for the moment. Revoke title. Hmm. Okay. Not much we can do then. Where's our Chancellor? <clears throat> Uh, oh, you're performing statecraft. Right, well, I want you to fabricate claims. I think we were going after Dublin. That's fine, that's fine. Research and cultural tech, that's fine. Let's have a look at tech, actually. Man of great military talent has been found. That is quite good. Yes. Become a commander. Excellent, thank you. Yeah, so take. Nope, nothing we can do there. I think I remember giving away yeah, give away Tottenham to please somebody. So I want to start improving film. Anybody in here up for ransom? Apart from you guys. Yes. Yes. Good. Of course, that's where all the income came from. I've forgotten I'd ransomed off some prisoners. Oh, well, you've been in prison for 33 years and you're 39. I don't even know why. Uh, yeah, let's... Uh, let's... Let's... Release from prison, there we are. Am I not merciful? Probably institutionalised by now though. Can't cope in the outside world. You have a new heir? No, I don't want to have a new heir. Oh, you're depressed. Should I release her? I didn't think so. Um, okay, so looking through this, I don't see any unhappiness because I've got his wife banged up in my prison. So let's just keep her there. Hmm, strange. Then you don't have any honorary titles or such like two thousand prestige compared with two thousand nine hundred and thirty eight prestige. I need to get more support then <coughs> for my choice. Dressed of the Isles. <coughs> oh, look. Dressed Ewa and Coerced. Dressed Ewa. So, Coerced. Of East Anglia. Coerced the monk. <coughs> I need to improve your opinion of me. So, honorary titles.
Okay, Keeper of the Swans. Take that. And how about if I send you a little gift? There we go. Now. Nominate Duke Ninian, please. Right, I can't believe we've been at peace for, God, it must be a, about a year or something. Maybe now we can concentrate on reclaiming our kingdom. Uh, I do know what to become stressed. <clears throat> Stress is worse than cancer for this bloodline. Uh, business folk is going to switch this out. Let's go for family focus. We can cope with that. Yeah, so... How long is it until I've run out of truce with England? Another six years. Duke Tlurgan, the fifth of Mori, has formed an alliance with Duke Currierst, the monk. No prisoners. Right, no prisoners, no visitors. Throw in the oublié. You'd be damned to your alliance. Okay, well I think I'm going to put a break in here. I received a visitor. Yep, yeah, I'll pick this up in the next part. So thanks very much for watching, I hope you've enjoyed this. Please leave me a comment and rate the video, and subscribe to the channel if you enjoy the content, and I hope to see you again next time. Cheers.